Hi, uh, it's Dr. Sarandi. Today we have a air-cooled Volkswagen block on our milling machine. And we've been asked to open this up for 90.5 millimeter cylinders. And that means we're going to have to take the stock bore out to about 96 millimeters. And we're going to show you how that's done. We have the block locked down with a couple of uh, toe clamps here, one on this side, one on the other side. And now we're going to go ahead and get the center is figured out and where we need to go for our board job. I'm going to start this by installing our tapered cone, which this will allow us to kind of find an instant center on this block. This is only one way to do this. Sometimes you can make up a uh, set of fixtures to go up in here and have a board or turn down for the uh, size of the board that you're going to be doing. All right, let's see what we got here. Alright, by looking at this, you can see that we've got a little bit of a gap in the back. And then we've got to get that straightened out. What we're going to do is look at the uh, digital readout up here. We're not going to really pay too much attention to it, but we're going to go ahead and turn our handle so that we can get the uh, cone as far down into the cylinder of the spigot board as we can. Pressure on the handle. Run this around. I'm going to back this up so you can kind of see what I'm doing here. I'm holding down on the handle and we're jiggling our handle until the table doesn't move anymore. Also, we do the same thing on the X axis. Okay, that looks good. We're going to take and zero out our X and our Y. So now that we have our starting point, which is zero, we can go ahead and do the other side now. The board centers on the Volkswagen are about 112 millimeters. up here again, we can see that our new coordinate is 100, minus 112 and 0 0.067 millimeters. We're going to leave it there, we're going to lock the table down, and that will be our first bore. Alright, well we're going to go ahead and cut our first hole. Concerned about all the RTV on there because we're going to take and deck the block once we get this uh, board out. Well, I'm moving my block over and taking it back to the zero zero on the digital readout, which was our first known position. And so now we'll go ahead and bore this one out.
messy job, but somebody's got to do it. left now is to do the other side and um, we're going to take and deck this before we get to the other side though. We'll change cutters. I'm going to bring this down and find out where our zero point is and lock the quill down. Back the table down a little bit. Taking ten thousandths off and it's cleaned up almost. I got a little bit over here on this side over here. I've got to, probably got another two or three thousandths. Alright, there's a total of thirteen, everything's cleaned up. Now we'll move the table over and do the other spigot board. good there. So now all we have to do is change this out for the other side, do it, and this job will be done. If you need to have this done to your case, you may call it Coast Mesa R&D. We'll see you soon.